Hello dear friends, welcome to all of you on the playlist on the process calculation and we are solving some problems on the process calculation on the system with no reaction happening. So the problem statement here is that MTBE methyl tertiary butyl ether is added to gasoline to increase the oxygen content of the gasoline. MTB is soluble in the water to some extent and becomes a contaminant when the gasolines get into the surface or underground water. The gasoline used by the boats has an MTBE content of the 10% and the boats operates in a well mixed flood control pond having the dimension 3 km long, 1 km wide and 3 m deep on the average. Suppose that each of the 25 watts on the pond spills 0.5 liter of the gasoline during 12 hours of the daylight. The flow of the water that contains no MTBE into the pond is 10 meter cube per hour. But no water leaves because the water level is well below the spillway of the pond. By how much will the concentration of the MTBE increases in the pond after the end of the 12 hour of the boating. So we are given with the specific gravity of the 0.72 which is for the gasoline. So in the problem statement we are given with a system of the ponds in which 25 boats are we boating and each boats consume 0.5 liter of the gasoline and we are further given in the problem statement that MTBE composition in the gasoline is the 10% and we are also given with the volume of the ponds that we can calculate by multiplying 3 km, 1 km and the 3 meter with the same unit. So we are also given with the specific gravity of the gasoline. So first uh, we need to identify what we need to find what is the requirement of the question so we are asked to calculate the concentration of the MTBE that increases if we bought for the 12 hour so this one is the structure of the MTBE methyl tertiary butyl ether and we have to find the concentrations means how much is the mass of the MTBE dissolved in the water if we are boating for the 12 hour of the process. So first we will find the mass of the MTBE and then we will find the mass of the water and we know that the concentration is nothing but the ratio of the solute to the solvent. So in this case MTBE is the sol uh, solute and the water is acting as a solvent. So first we need to find the mass of the MTBE. We know that uh, one boat consumes 0.5 liter of the gasoline so if we have 12 uh, sorry if we have 25 boats then uh, the amount that they will consume will be multiple of the 25. So we multiply with the 25 so we have the answer in the liter to uh, convert into the centimeter cube we use the convenient factor 1000 centimeter cube is equal to 1 liter. So finally we have the 12500 centimeter cube of the gasoline that is the volume that 25 watts consume during the 12 hour of the process. So now we use the formula to calculate the mass. We know that density is equal to the mass over volume. So as we are now in a system which is relative to the water, so the replacement of the density we use specific gravity. So we have mass of the gasoline is equal to volume multiplied by specific gravity and we are given with the specific gravity which is 0.72. So putting the value we get 12500 multiplied by 0 0.72 so we have mass equal to 9000 gram so keep in mind that this is not the mass of the MTBE 
further we have calculate to the mass of the mtbe and we also know the composition of the mtbe in the gasoline fraction so we are told that uh, mtbe in the given gasoline is the 10 percentile so converting it into the fraction we get 0.1 so multiply with the mass fraction of the uh, mtbe in the gasoline so we end up with the answer mass of the mtbe equal to the 900 gram so this is the mass of the solute that we will need in calculating the concentration so our next step is to calculate the mass of the water that is enclosed in that pound which is our system so we are given in the problem statement the length width and the depth of the pound which are respectively 3 km 1 km and the 3 meter so first we need to convert 3 km and the 1 km into the meter so we have volume of that pound equal to 3000 multiplied by 1000 and multiplied by 3 so here we have volume of that pound 3 3 gets 9 and 9 into 10 raised to power 6 is the volume of that pound so now we need to find the mass of the water so that we can calculate the concentration so here we have we are using the previous relation which is density equal to the mass over volume we know that the density of the water is 1000 kilogram per meter cube and meter cube and meter cube got cancelled and we have the answer 9 multiplied by 10 rise to the power 9 kilogram converting into, into the gram because we uh, get the answer of the MTB in the gram so we will have the mass of the at water 9 multiplied by 10 is to power 12 gram so now using our formula for the concentration mass of the MTBE divided by the mass of the at water so putting these value we get concentration equal to the 1 multiplied by 10 is to power minus 10 gram of the MTBE that is solute and per gram of the H2O that is solvent so this is the final answer my dear friends if you have any doubts or queries in any step you can drop in the comment section so if you found that video helpful let me know by just hitting the like button thank you so much